pre-mission was a lot of fun. It was really exciting. I was up at BYU when I got my call and I had my family and friends come in. That was really exciting. And then I had about a month between when I got done with school and when I left, about a month and a half. And so it was really busy. I was trying to see friends, trying to do all this stuff and get ready at the same time. So it was really hectic, but it was a lot of fun. It was really exciting. One thing I wish I had done though was teach with the missionaries. Honestly, I don't remember a time where I actually met a real missionary until I got to the MTC. And so I've n I'd never taught a lesson for real. And that's one thing I really wish I had done. If I had just called up the missionary and said, hey, can I go teach with you sometime? I'd really like to get that practice. Because that's huge. There's nothing better you can do than to prepare than to actually do missionary work, to actually teach the lessons and study Preach My Gospel. Become familiar with the material before the MTC so that way you can just hit the ground running when you get there. And that will really help a lot. Because that way you're more comfortable when you're sharing your experiences, when you're telling people about Joseph Smith. You're more comfortable going from the first lesson into the second lesson. Or Sorry, I'm jumping ahead, but you're more comfortable switching from the restoration into the plan of salvation right in the middle of the first lesson. You're going to have to do that a lot. You're going to have to be very flexible. And that's not easy right at the beginning. So the more practice you get at the beginning before your mission, the easier it's going to be to... Um, struggle for words. But to adapt to the needs of the people because they're very, very specific. Each person is a little bit different. One person's not going to... One person's going to need the restoration first. The next person's going to need the gospel of Jesus Christ first. Someone's going to start out with the restoration, then you're going to have to go into the plan of salvation sometimes, and you need to practice how to do that. And then, as far as the MTC goes, I served a Spanish-speaking mission, so I was there for nine weeks, and I loved it. I loved the MTC. Most people didn't. They always talked bad about it, like, oh, it's a prison, oh, it sucks. It's what you make of it. It's as good as you... It's as good as you make it. I really enjoyed it. It was nice to just be able to follow the schedule and just work hard and study hard. And then once it came time to go, it was great. It was exciting. And I found that most people, once they got to the field, wished they were there a little bit longer in the MTC. So just be glad for the time that you have and make it a, and make it a good experience because it can be.